So, so what what kind of tips would you give people who are thinking about coming out here next Bring year? Bring warm clothes. <laughs> right? Yes. Bring all clothes. Yes. Because it, it's, it's been hot all week until Sunday of the June Fiesta, and now it is freezing. Guys, flying right now. Um, this is incredible. On my Tip number, what is this, three? 
Um, I gave some tips too, so oh, probably. 10? No, I don't know. <laughs> um, definitely try walking or taking or riding a bike or taking the bus. Way faster. So much faster. We drove the first day. They closed the roads to get back to our RV. And it took us over an hour to get back because um, they had the road closed. So definitely walk, ride your bike, or take the bus. So it is officially the end of the rally. Um, what an amazing week. Um, if you're looking for community and you just can't find it, if you're traveling, um, we highly, highly recommend joining a group, whether that's full-time families or anything else. Um, it's changed everything. Yeah. If you have young kids, or uh, a young family, even if you're like a, we met people who are middle-aged, mm -hmm. who had like teenagers, but if you're looking to find like, because the road does get lonely at times, yeah. if you're looking to find where your kids can like hang loose and you can kind of let your hair down, full-time families is definitely the way to go in my opinion. We met a lot of good people mm -hmm. in a small amount of time who were like super knowledgeable, um, people who were five years plus into full-time RVing. They've had almost every type of rig you could have. Yes. We even met people who owned, uh, who lived on boats for a year. Yeah, and there are so many activities for the kids, things for the adults. Yeah. Um, and they just, give you the time away. Yes. Yeah, so that's pretty cool. So awesome, so highly recommend that. Right now we're going to go enjoy these full hookups and we will catch up with you guys later.